to May 1st baseball. Right now, our Boston Red Sox are 12 and 16, seven games out of first place. We've lost three in a row, but it looks like we're gonna play another game at Fenway afternoon. Thursday baseball, and hopefully we'll break the streak. We got Kurt Schilling versus Jay Velarde. Let's see what we can do. Tigers are going for their eighth win in as many games. Hello and welcome everyone. Dwayne Kuyper joined by former Giants All-Star Mike Kruko for tonight's MVP baseball game with EA Sports. The starter, Kurt Schilling. Tonight's game is between the Detroit Tigers and the Boston Red Sox. So I think the strategy is going to be more towards... Here's the game's uh, first batter, Alex Sanchez. Alex Sanchez. Here's a guy that Trying understands hitting, and possible, it shows. Because I don't know how good of a hitter I am right now, being the second game back. Or, I should say, I do know the game begins with the ball. Oh, God. I should say I do know what kind of a hitter I am now. I'm a terrible one, so we're going to... Try Hit and get right to compensate for that. Nixon makes the catch. Stepping yeah. in, Ivan Rodriguez. Does he have a 299 on base percentage with a 305 batting average? I don't think he's walked all season. This guy doesn't strike out too many batters, but he still manages to get guys out. I can't believe how slow his fastball is now. Here's the pitch. Grounded to third. Pitching effective so two outs. Line drive right, right to the second two. baseman. Kike's okay, quick reaction allowed him to make the play on that line drive. Nice play. It's actually a very quick inning. And this guy looks like the type of guy we can rock, so. Maybe we can't get some momentum going. We'll find out. Up next, Johnny Damon. On an occasion, this hitter really doesn't hit for average, but he'll get the job done. Terrific pitch there, partner. He put the fastball right where he wanted it for a called strike. Misses for a ball. A great day to play, not a cloud in the sky. Misses for a ball. Two and two the count. Hit towards third base. Got him for the out. At least they didn't strike out there. Dirksen will hit next. And a strike on the inside corner. With only three pitches, Kai, he's pretty predictable. Behind in the count, 0 and 2. He put that pitch right where the catcher called for it. The batter was simply overmatched. Struck him out. Fastball on the outside corner. Three pitches, three strikes. Didn't get easier than that, partner. It's a pitch you have to take. Next at the plate, Manny Ramirez. This guy isn't anything special when he digs in against left-handed pitching. 
Sometimes you try to make the hitter chase your pitch. That's exactly what you saw right there. Change up misses low. This guy usually pitches deep into the game whenever he starts. You will not see him tire out very often. He fires a heater for a strike, 98 miles per hour on the gun. And here's the delivery. He's got one win and no losses so far. Full count here. Sometimes you try to make the hitter chase your pitch. That's exactly what you saw right there. The God damn. retired in order. <laughs> After one, no score here. Oh, some of these pitches, man. They're just... Barnes oh, up next. Nice. So fast. Right. Meanwhile, we have slow shilling. Hit towards oh. second base. I'm gonna like to give Trot Nixon the ball so we can throw it. Be an inside the park home run. A today. three base hit. Don't allow it. I thought there was no way he'd get near that ball, but he made a great effort and made the batter sweat a little bit. <laughs> yeah, when you throw that slow, there's really not much you can do other than just make sure it's not a hanger, but I'm kind of hung. Your attention, please. The throwing of any materials in the direction or off of the field. The next batter is Lyle Overbay. This left-hander is solid. He's a solid hitter. It's hit out towards short. Hit two, hit two. And he scores the first run of the game. It up on a roll. There's a double play. Now there's a great example of the defense exactly picking you up. They turned a sweet double play right there. with a two-out single. The with Fenway on the right side. Sitting all over so that pitch. She got it about belt high and hit it to the outfield with authority. Now that's a big so league base ground. hit. Trot's actually a good fielder. Okay, this dude perfect. just knows how to steal a bag. He studies film, he studies pitchers, and he can be trying to apply all that right now. In the hole. That'll do it for the Tigers in the second. Heading right. into the bottom well, of the second, the score is one to nothing. Next up, David Ortiz. Sometimes you try to make the hitter chase your pitch. That's exactly what you saw right there. Well, that Three balls in one strike. And now it's a full count. He'll throw the fastball when he gets into trouble. I think it's his best pitch. And he takes the walk. I'll take it. Stepping in, Mike Lowe. Out of the zone, that's a ball. Hey, partner, if the pitcher can keep the ball low in the zone, he might be able to induce a ground ball to start, too. He averages about four walks per nine innings. Not terrible, but not great. He misses the strike zone with a 98-mile-an-hour heater. Runners on first and second with the walk. Up next, Trot Nixon. 
Here's the pitch. One ball, no strikes. Kuyper, look for them to wave that runner home if the ball hit the center. That center field does not throw many guys out at home. 1-1 one, one count. He misses the strike zone with a 98-mile-an-hour heater. This left-hander has one dominant out pitch. 3-1 count. He threw one out of the strike zone here, hoping the batter would bite. Walk number three close. given up in the ball game. Nothing positive comes out of this guy. Nibble. He's fall behind, he's fall behind, he finally walks the ball. Versus southpaw pitching, this guy is just plain ordinary. He's got a four-seamer, an average change, and a decent sinker. One ball, one strike. All you want to do right here is make sure you drive the ball the out. That fastball was clocked at 98 miles an hour, but it missed for a ball. He comes up a little bit short. A run crosses the plate. A two RBI single. When you throw so many balls, it's kind of easy to see the strike. So. Miyagi is next. No outs with runners at first and second. Painted the corner, great pitch. There we go. He turns on one and hits a sharp liner. He reaches with a single. Got a good pitch to hit right there, and he put it in the outfield for a single. for a ball 1-0. and He's pitched 25 innings this season, and batters own this guy with a season average of 303. All he needs is a deep fly ball, and they should score a run. And he gets that call on a close pitch. Two balls in one strike. There's a close pitch called a ball. Sometimes you try to make a hitter chase your pitch. That's exactly what you saw right there. A walk forces home a run. He's good. Walks always seem to come around and hurt you. He's far behind the back, so he never gets back to the back. Next up to play, Johnny Damon. He misses with a 97 mile per hour heater. There's a strike. One two count. That's three strikeouts. Ty, he put that pitch right there. You could not ask for a better strikeout pitch. Lieutenant pitchers won't be worried too much about this hitter. If he can hit the ball deep to the outfield, they'll get a run. <laughs> a three-pitch strikeout. Yeah, he's found his velocity and his control now. A little too long ago. The next batter is Manny Ramirez. Out of the zone, that's a ball. That was a purpose pitch. A changeup off the plate, hoping the batter would go chasing. He misses with a 97 mile per hour heater. He delivers a call strike. And here's the delivery. Oh, I can't get this one the yeah. The bat went through the zone. Got him with the fastball. After two innings, the score is 3-1. Oh, to one. man. I'm better than that. That's okay, though. We got three runs out of it. I'm impressed. Because I did not think we'd score three runs today. One out. Two. Sanchez strolls to the plate. Hey, partner, this dude can fly. Infielders have to be on their toe and alert for the butt. Touch the middle. He's on first with a base hit. Hey, he was looking fastball all the way. That's a nice hit. 
Here's the pitch. There's a line drive. Sanchez might score on this. He's rounding third. Rodriguez has himself a two base hit. Damon did his best to prevent extra bases, but to no avail. So we've got a man on second and third with nobody out. I'm not one to intentionally block people, so but I'll at least try to make This is a hitter who's consistently average in the box. A shilly delivers and it's one and oh. He popped him up. That looks a lot better. He's got it for the out. Barnes is the next hitter. Here's a righty that has pretty good success against right-handed pitching. This guy usually pitches deep in the game whenever he starts. You will not see him tire out very often. The delivery. Right at the knees for a strike. He fouled it off to the left. That one glances off the pitcher. And a run comes home. And the runner scores on that two out hit. Next up, Lyle Overbay. Made it hittable when he hit it. Right to the pitcher. He fouled it off to the right. That's fouled off the catcher. A three pitch strikeout. After two and a half, the score is three to two. So out six hits in three innings. Stepping in, David Ortiz. Up there on the mound with no stuff. Just missed. This guy will punch out more than a few batters each time he starts. That sinker didn't sink. High Looks for like a ball. Lost all of his control again. He got a strike upstairs. That is pinpoint control right there. The catcher set a target on the corner, and the pitcher just hammered it for a strike. Payoff pitch coming. Got him. Well, you talk about making a good pitch. Right there, he's really backed up against the wall. And then he digs deep, makes great pitches, and gets the strike out. And a strike. Inside, one ball and one strike. Okay, this first pitch is usually a strike, and he'll follow that with strike two, and hey, oftentimes he'll do strike three as well. He made a real good pitch for strike three, Mike. Hey, he gets strike <sighs> one, he just keeps plowing away for the strikeout. Up next, Trot Nixon. This batter desperately needs to improve against southpaw pitching. Change up low. Kipe, I'm pretty sure he's not trying to throw all those balls on purpose. Pitch misses. Didn't find the plate for a ball. Probably just that was a perfect pitch. A change up off the plate, hoping the batter would go chasing. That's the pitcher's fifth walk of the game. Oh, it's too bad he walks this guy. He just lets him get away. Pitch misses. This guy can struggle with his control at times and is known to give up a few walks. Gets a strike high in the strike zone. The 1-1 pitch. Ball high. Okay, with that first baseman holding the runner on, there's a big hole in the right side of the infield. He's got to be thinking about that with the hit and run. 2-2 Two -two count. Ball. 
The count is full. That was a purpose pitch. He was trying to get the batter to chase. Nixon is running on the pitch. Kai, he showed a great eye right there. He was patient, worked the pitcher, and ended up with a free pass. Miyagi steps into the box. Pitch misses for a ball. If the hit goes to right field, they may not want to run. The right fielder's got a cannon for an arm. Misses with the fastball, 96 miles an hour. Sometimes you try to make the hit or chase your picks. That's exactly what you saw right there. That's the final out, inning over. After three innings, the score is three to two. Mato steps into the batter's box. This lefty's average is just plain ordinary. The ball is back, way back, off the wall. Hey, third base. That's a double. That was not an easy pitch to hit, but he was able to lay out a double. This guy isn't great against right-handed pitching, but he does all right. Looking for the bunt single. Schilling got him with the tag. Young comes to the plate. Liner right at the third baseman. That's out number two. Low really made a nice throw right there. That's a job well done. This ready really becomes invisible against right-handed pitching. And he makes the catch in stride. Going into the bottom of the fourth, the score is three to two. Sometimes you try to make a hit or chase your picks. That's exactly what you saw right there. Change misses downstairs. He's batting 252 with one home run and seven RBIs. Hitters count three and one. There's the seventh base on balls he's allowed in the game. Hey, meet, make him earn it. Killing me. Dirksen steps in at the plate. The count's even at one. The inside outs the pitch to the right side. The inside outs the pitch to the right side. He's on first with a base hit. Kind of good job of hitting away from the defense right there. Found a hole. Now the next batter is Manny Ramirez. No outs and the bases are jammed. 1 0 count. Pitch taken for a ball. Here's a great opportunity for a cheap run to sack fly. All he's got to do is lift it to medium deep outfield. Two 
ball, two strike count. Makes the catch to record the out. Hey, that's a great play on a very tough line drive. That's one of the toughest balls in baseball to judge. It's hit out towards short. Out number three with two men left on base. After four, the Tigers trail by only one run. Stepping in, one for two, Alex Sanchez. Alex Sanchez. If the infield backs up one step, he'll put down a play. Popped up in foul territory, but he has room for a play. In foul territory, makes the catch. Next up, Ivan Rodriguez. The manager can usually rely on his righty batter to have a productive at bat against right handed pitching. The pitch is pulled out to the left side. There's an out. Whoa, really made a nice throw right there. That's a job well done. He goes out to right. One, two, three, and the inning is over. After four and a half, the score is three to two. Lowell takes under his hands for a ball. And the pitch. One ball, two strikes. That sinker tumbled right through the strikes, and the batter just could not touch it. The home plate ump asked for help at first. Now batting. Base is empty with one out. Fielder makes the catch. Jackson steps into the batter's box. Pitch taken for a ball. Sometimes you try to make the hitter chase your pitch. That's exactly what you saw right there. Why would I swing? He went oh. the went around. And the pitch. Out of the zone, that's a ball. Two balls, two strikes. Better had no choice right there. Take it, and it's a strike. What a sweet pitch. One, two, three, and the inning is over. With five innings played, the score is three to two. Barnes sprays it to right field. There's another single. He's going to have to hit the spots with his fastball or he's going to get ripped all day long. Stepping in, Lyle Overbay. Foul back behind the plate. A liner. He's got it. The Tigers are warming some relievers in the bullpen. Now the play is the left field. One down. Ground ball hit to short. Hard slide. Can they turn it? The runner was on the second baseman like a freight train, but he kept his concentration and still got the runner at first. He may have been injured on the play. Crook and I certainly wish him the best. Going into the bottom of the six, the score is three to two. Oh. 
takes a pitch just off the plate. One and zero. Take a good pitch, but call the ball. Kite that foul is because the batter swung late. Two one pitch. Up the middle. Another single. This lefty hitter is just plain regular against left-handed pitchers. Down low for a ball. Fork and this guy, he is done. They need to go to the bullpen right now and get things back on track. Up next, Johnny Davis. Takes the pitch just off the plate, 1 0. Sometimes you try to make the hitter chase your pitch. That's exactly what you saw right there. Two balls in those strikes. He swiped nine bases. Nobody out. And a little low. They set that defense a double play depth. If you can get a ground ball right here, they might get two. That's the eighth free pass he's issued in the ball game. Nothing positive comes out of this guy. Did just fall behind, just fall behind, and finally watch the ball. A ball. All this guy's got to do is hit the ball marginally deep, and they should score the run from third easily. Pitchers ahead, one and two. He's hitting 319 with four long balls and 15 RBIs. And here's the delivery. Pitch misses. They're going to have to do something out there. Some of these pitches ain't even close. He's out on strikes. Hey, partner. The steal turn from hockey. That strikeout was the old hat trick for that guy. Next at the plate, Manny Ramirez. One out and the base is loaded. Pitch taken for a ball. Fastball missed away for a ball. All this guy's got to do is hit the ball marginally deep, and they should score the run from third easily. And the count is two and one. Swinging strike on the fastball away. He's hitting back to the dugout. Strike three. Hey, partner, the steal turned from hockey. That strikeout was the old hat trick for that guy. Like many lefties, this guy has his struggles against left-handed pitching. No balls in one strike. the third base umpire if he swung. That's out number three with three runners left on base. With three innings left to play, the score is three to two. The seven, eight, nine hitters will be coming up. Rowe hits this one to second. They got him at first. The corners are playing the lines. 
The next batter is Dimitri Young. Although this guy hits both ways, his swing is much more refined batting right-handed. He could be the go-ahead run. Line drive right to the shortstop. They got him. A liner. He's on first with a base hit. What a good bat right there. He knew what he was looking for, got it, and executed on it. Singing the take me out to the ball game at Wrigley, I was scared to death. This is a good move, Kite, because right handed hitters have some trouble picking up off speed pitches from right handed pitchers. Next up, Mike Lowe. are hugging the line. And there's a swing and a miss. No balls in one strike. A three-pitch strikeout. Three pitches, three strikes. Doesn't get easier than that, partner. Slider misses high. Lay off that slider right into the corner for a swing and strike. Jackson takes and it's two and one. Pitch taken for a ball. In fact, the pitcher and catcher have a strategy in mind. So far, the batters are taking these pitches. It's a full count. He draws the wall. Oh, it's too bad he watched this guy. He just lets him get away. Here comes the first pitch of the at bat. Seven, the score is three to two. Stepping in one for three, Ivan Rodriguez. Bringing in a righty to face the right-handed hitter is a good move, partner, because it creates a mismatch in the pitcher's favor. Your attention. Steve Bazaar. Report to the team. 
swing and a miss. There's a line drive. He's on with a leadoff single. Stayed with that pitch over the outside court and went the other way for the knock. Here comes the first pitch of the at-bat. Rounds one the opposite way. They got him. Double play. Hey, late in the game, double plays are doubly important. Clutch pitching and great fielding right there. Stepping in, Rondell White. There's more than just a few righty hitters who are superior against right-handed pitchers than this guy. Curves foul. The go-ahead run is on deck. The pitch. Strokes this one into left field. Third out, we go to the bottom of the inning. After seven and a half, Detroit trails by one. to the right side. Cuts it off. Out! Hey, I'm sure he came out here with the intention of having a great game, but hey, it's baseball. Sometimes things just don't work out the way you plan it. On the ground. There's another single. The partner, that was just a good piece of hitting there to get the same. Next at the plate, Manny Ramirez. The runner's moving. He just stole second. Well, there's a perfect example of the pitcher forgetting all about that base runner. He got a big lead and stole it easily. Oh. Take slow. Sometimes you try to make the hitter chase your pitch. That's exactly what you saw right there. Grounder hit the other way. They make the play at first. Okay, this dude did not bring his A game in, but A, in fairness, he can't be on all the time. The next batter is Lyle Overbid. It's do or die time right now. They have to manufacture a run here. They're making a pitching change. They've gone to the closer, Keith Fulk. He could be the go ahead run. him up. First baseman makes the catch. The pitch is hit to left field. Ramirez makes the routine catch. He tracked that ball very well off the bat. Camped under. Made the easy play. On 
and miss. Here's the 0-2 pitch. The count's one and two. Rowe lays off ball two. Okay, what a great way to end the game if you're on the pitcher's team. Keith Fulton picks up the save. The Boston Red Sox win it by one.